what's up guys sonny victor here welcome back again to my youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how to set up trade on the real kill bot using the 15 margin strategy so before i proceed with this video i'd like you guys to do me a very big favor by tapping the subscribe button to subscribe to my youtube channel and also tap the bell button to get notifications anytime i upload new videos so without further ado let's dive in let's dig in and let's go straight to the main business so the first things first make sure you have usdt on your binance account you need at least 220 usdt on your binance account to make use of this 15 margin strategy so currently i have 318 dollars right here so now let's go back to the royal keyboard app so on the royal keyboard app the next step is to uh click on quantitative to select the coin we want to set up a trade for so but before that okay if you haven't activated your royal keyboard you need to activate it to set up a trade on it and also make sure you click on mine here and click on the professional edition to enable the professional edition you'll be asked three questions once you answer those three questions you'll be able to enable the professional edition and you will have access to more coins on the real keyboard so once you click on quantitative right here you will have access to the coins on the real keyboard so now we are going to select a coin and set up a trade for that coin so the coin that i'm going to select right here is mdx so this mdx is a very good coin you can even use it as a collateral okay to borrow cash on binance so if you are setting up a coin or uh, setting up a trade for any coin make sure it's a coin that you can actually order for a long time just in case the price start dropping so you don't hurry and sell your coins at loss and take note this real cube bot will never sell your coins at loss it is programmed in such a way that it will always sell and take profit for you so if you do not make profit this bot will not sell your coins at loss okay except if you decide to uh, sell your coins manually yourself at loss so now let's set up the trade without wasting time so i'm going to click on trade setting and boom i'm going to uh configure the settings so as you can see right here on the screen the first buying amount is ten dollars so if you are using 280 dollars usdt on binance your first buying amount must be ten dollars so if you actually have more than 280 dollars you can decide to uh, enable the open position double so this actually means that you want the bot to be buying double of the first buy in a month which is going to be twenty dollars so instead of ten dollars this bot will buy twenty dollars for you once you enable the open position double which is actually going to increase your profit uh, massively that's if you have enough usdt so the margin call limit now don't forget we are using 15 margin call strategy so we are in this I did this to 15 and the whole position take profit will be 1.3 percent so the whole position take profit callbacks we are it to 0.1 percent and uh, the next step now is to click on the margin configuration okay so that we can configure uh the margin call drop and the multiple bar in ratio so what you are actually seeing here is the bot default settings so we are going to uh edit it to our own taste right now so now the first call we are going to edit it to one percent so if the price of mdx or whatever coin you're setting up a trade for drops by one percent you want the bot to buy 1.1 okay and if the price drops by under one percent you buy 1.2 okay so that's how you set it so from uh from the first call to the 15 call we actually be one one percent okay so we change it to one one let me parse so i've edited all to one one percent so this one one point three one point four 
1.91 that's 2 okay so the next one is 2.1 2.2 2.3 2.4 so all done so the next step is to make sure you click on confirm if you do not click on confirm the settings will not be saved so once you click on confirm the settings will be saved and the next step now is for we to uh click on this sub position take profit okay this sub position take profit we are going to edit it as well so now I'm gonna click on distributed and tick okay this is what we are going to do now distributed and take profit allocation first so we are going to edit it so the fifth sub position we are going to change it to 1.1 the sixth we also change it to 1.1 so the seventh we also change it to 1.1 okay till the eighth position so the eighth position 1.1 so we are going to click on uh confirm before we click on confirm we are going to change the rest to one okay one one percent the rest will be one one percent one 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 okay make sure you do it right so we are going to click on confirm so i just clicked on confirm now okay so the next step now is to edit this sub position take profit call back to 0 0.1 so i'll make this 0 0.1 okay then i'm going to click on save at the right top corner okay so if I click on save, don't forget I actually have more than $280. So as for me, I will enable the open position double. So if you have $2,800, your first buying amount will be $100. You get it. So that just it. Open position double. Then I'm gonna click on save. Boom. Then the next step now is to click on start. So I want to start the engine. Confirm. So now i just clicked on start and the next thing now is you see that the bot has bought uh 20 dollars okay because i click i actually enable the open position doubled if you do not enable the open position double it should be ten dollars so as you can see now uh i can click on transaction record to see my transactions as the bot is buying and selling so this 15 margin configuration has been working for uh, other leaders so I decided to use it as well and I believe since it's working for other people it's going to work for us as well so you guys can make use of it so that just it guys if you need to subscribe make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out my other video updates i'll see you guys in the next video until next time peace out